force is with all of us. And when I say force, I mean sunshine, at least in this Yay. particular uh, version. Let me take you outside. If you're enjoying your May the 4th over in Daytona Beach, look at that. Clear skies, wonderful day. Thousands and thousands of folks, both locals and visitors alike, out enjoying the water. It was a little bumpy out on the boats, but uh, with temperatures currently running at about 80 degrees, you can't complain. But look at the dew point. 47 degrees is the dew point. That means uh, we've got a real dry air mass in place. Really, really great afternoon. 83 degrees now in Orlando. It's 82 degrees in the villages, 82 in Ocala. Readings just a little bit below average this afternoon, but the humidity or lack thereof made all the difference in the world. And as we look ahead at the forecast tonight with the drier air mass, those temperatures are able to cool much quicker than normal. So we'll drop off to 72 degrees, 9 o'clock, into the 60s by 11, and we keep going on down in downtown Orlando. How's about into Marion County? Look how quickly you drop by 11 o'clock. 67 degrees will be in the 50s, though, for your morning tomorrow. And Daytona Beach, a wonderful looking forecast 69 degrees, 11 o'clock. And again, for you, lower 60s and upper 50s. Now, here's a look at the bigger picture clear skies for the entire Sunshine State. There's that front, all of that moisture pushing away from us with that nice northerly breeze. But look at the water vapor channel here of the satellite imagery. It is all about this dry air that's just sitting right over the entire peninsula. Those oranges, those reds, really denoting that bone dry atmosphere. So as we look ahead to tonight, it's a perfect forecast. We drop off to 57 in the villages, about 54 Ocala, 59 degrees in Claremont. Overnight, we'll drop to 60 degrees in Orlando. Some areas just outside the city, like Longwood and Altamont Springs, will get into the 50s, about 57 degrees Paisley, 61 degrees in Cocoa, and 61 degrees as well for us in New Smyrna Beach. Now, tomorrow, if you've got the day off or just making plans after work, it's another gorgeous setup. Like, uh, take a look at the temperatures. We're hitting 87, as a matter of fact, in Sanford, about 88 villages, 83 degrees Palm Coast, 84 degrees Forest Daytona Beach. First alert future cast is as clear as can be. Here's overnight, nothing to track out there. And as we wake up in the morning, it is also a clear quiet setup. Now, we're in the month of May. This is when we begin to bring those rain chances up. Typically, during the month, we see about three and a half inches of rain. But June and July is when we really kick up those rain chances and really kind of get into our Central Florida rainy season. But that's not the case this week. Bone dry weather, 88 for your Monday, 90 Tuesday and Wednesday, even warmer for your Thursday.